Hi, I'm Brad Koneman. I'm here at the Biblical School of Theology in Myanmar meeting with some of the Bible College students that 13.3 is supporting. I've been really encouraged meeting Stephen. Stephen told me that he is willing to die a martyr's death and that his life, uh, in life or in death, might be used to, to grow God's kingdom. Uh, my name is Stephen and I come from Chin Hills. I was born to Christian parents and I was born again when I was nine and the Lord called me to serve Him. And I believe God will reach the whole Myanmar with His gospel not many days from now. We have a great heart for the loss and we depend on God. We walk on foot, we travel here and there in the sun, in the rain, and we share the gospel as much as we can so that people will believe Lord Jesus Christ as their Savior and Lord because without hearing the word there's no way for them to be saved. Their main religion is Buddhism and many people are very strong in their religion but as Jesus says the harvest truly is reap, but the laborers are so few so pray to the Lord of the harvest that he might send many laborers in the fields. There are people among all the people who are ready to be harvested, who are ready to receive the gospel. If somebody goes and tells about Jesus, they are ready to receive Christ. But since the laborers are so few, they are gone. We pray that God will use us to bring light into this dark country. We believe that where persecution is there, the gospel rapidly runs. So we try to find even persecutions. <laughs> we are strong in faith and we need people who will pray for us faithfully. Without prayer, we can do nothing. So prayer, no prayer, no power. We need to pray for others. People need to pray for us so that we can do the work of God more effectively for the glory of God.